my god, it's canon! Hello everybody, my name is Earthdark42, and welcome to Escape from Siberia. Last time we left off. Okay, so we found Alfred, who is southern Canada, and we just kicked Canada's ass by holding a spell on him as Romano. So now we gotta kick some ass. What was that noise? Get the fuck out of my way! Kick some mass. Kick some mass. Headbutt. <laughs> I haven't played as Romano in so long. Fire! Ow! I'm blind! Oh shit, 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 oh shit. Holy! Oh, they told you no. Vaya! And that's how you do it, Daddy and Stadia. Wow! So you're the escapee? I found a you to pass here. Get out of my way. Hunting a bella is just not my style. I don't give a damn. Ooh, hi, you're kind of cutesy. And now you're gonna die. Oh, shit! All the way down. I can't tell if that would be a German or oh, no, it would be a Canadian. What have you done to Mr. Villians? Why is your voice so fucking soft? I don't understand. Oh shit, 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 Eat the prey. No. Holy. Oh, holy crap. I think I knocked my front door. Go, let me knock. This guy's tough. Oh my god, I'm scared. Not so tough anymore. On level 10, provoked land. I did prepare this, but if you keep up this behavior, I will have to throw you back to your cell. Bring it on, the bitchy. Fight! Fight! Wait for me, Feliciano. Oh! Ah! <laughs> BFF! What when you going, bastard? Uh, how? What was that for? Antonio. Y you! You're that pest! Why are you here? I was told you were thrown into the West Tower cells and... Oh, I see. <laughs> You're trying to escape. <laughs> I was wondering what all the noise was about. You're the cause of it, aren't you? Well, don't, well, don't you have a, don't you have quite a nerve? You cause a revolution, bring innocent people into it, and now you're escaping your punishments. 
I don't want to fight you. Fuck you, Antonio. <sighs> I don't want to fight you, Antonio. <laughs> like you have a choice. This time, I know I have the right to beat you down. Ole! Use false so so so! Stop using false so so Alright, fuck I'm using. Da ma 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 da I was not supposed to. I was supposed to say, Fuck you, Antonio! Watch where you're going. Hey, it's you. You're the, you're escaping. What the hell? Uh, fuck you, Antonio. I'll head but you. It may you remember your shit. How dare you forget about me? Ha. <laughs> Stop blabbering, you snobby brat. Don't talk to me like I'm a little child fucking... Staranzo. I don't know Italian or Spanish. I'm going to make you remember me wh whether you like it or not. Most of these problems can be solved by getting smacked in the head anyway. What? You wanna fight me? <laughs> ha! You look like a brat that needs to be beaten down a few times to learn. Are you fucking blind? What part of me looks like a brat? I'm full of handsomeness! I'll show you what I can... Do the fuck you up. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to lose again. Wait. Throw scones at him. <gasps> That's it. And scones hose. Oh, shit. Another bread. And then that. Full health. And then that. I don't want to waste the scones. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, this is getting a little intense. Ow, ow. Finish him. Fatality. Wow! <laughs> that took forever. <laughs> How's that for a fight, huh? I can fight too. I've gotten stronger than before. Even stronger than you now, so... So this time, I'm going to protect you. Like how you used to protect me before. I can do the same for you now. So please, don't say you don't know me. 
You're making no sense. I don't know you. Again. My heart hurts. Why? Voices. Antonio! From now on, your boss is me, Antonio. Make sure to listen to what your boss says. Dance, Lavino. Don't lose, Lavino. I'll be right beside you, so you don't have to be afraid of... Sadki. If you're going to attack Lavina in my house, then you're going to have to beat me up, and I'm going to have to beat you up first. What's this? Am I being delusional again? Arthur. I've been attacked so many times now. Isn't it about time you did something with those pirates? <laughs> no, 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 my ship off the boats! I paid good money for it! Why don't, well, why not let the Brother Serene Knight for good under my roof? Cuba, Cuba, Cuba! Die, Alfred! Legiano. Arthur. Alfred. Ha. Huh. Lefino. It's really good that your... S. Your face. It's the last... Yours is the last face. I'll see. I don't think I can hold on anymore. Hey! Damn it! I won't acknowledge something as pathetic as this as your last request, damn it. W wait for me. I'll do something about this, but I'm not promising anything. You're lovey. Uh, I need to go to puke. That's right. That's just not, not, not that. That's not just my imagination. That's where all my, why, why didn't I remember? Antonio, you were so worn down and... No, I, no, I did this, didn't I? I pushed I pushed Phil and Lovey away, betrayed them and hit them. Hey, what are you? Let me pass here! Whoa, 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 wait, whoa, yo. I'm here to talk to life and please let me through. That voice is Fleetiano. Philly? Wait! Those scars are over there! Lovey, I know there's a lot I need to say to you, but hold on to the thought for a moment now. <sighs> Did you just... We'll talk... Uh, we'll talk in a bit. Hurry! Please, I beg of you! Let me see Ivan! I'm telling you again! If you don't have an appointment, an appointment and approval, you can't talk to Mr. Brzezinski. Just go get the paperwork needed. If you're in a hurry to talk to him, I will even ask Mr. Bittersmith to speed up the process for you. But you need the files first. No, I need to talk directly to Ivan. I need to give him his heart back. His heart? What are you talking about? I can't understand him. Is there something wrong with me or... No, it's okay. I can't really understand him either. Those from Villa are hard to talk to. Hmm, but I can't help but think I've seen him from somewhere. Do you know him? Or do you know him? Or do you know him? Well, no, but... I know I've seen that face before. You guys stop chit-chatting! And help me out here. I can't do this anymore. I already think about it. You can do it. You guys! Please just let me see Ivan. Ugh. You're getting on my last nerves. If you don't leave, I will beat you. Wait a moment, please. If you're going to do that, please... Do it after it this hour. By that time, you'll be off your shift. You really don't like fighting, don't you? Didn't you know? People from Alpinia are known for their love and pe love for peace. Oh! That's such a cute joke! A little help here? Um, wait a moment. 
big brother Antonio and Joe, dear brother. Ritello, hug. Ritello, your game, Ritello. I'm so glad I'm so relieved. Hmm, of course I'm alright. Who the hell do you think I am? Ve, you're right. <laughs> Antonio, do you know them? Yes, it's my henchman and his brother. That's great. Hey, that's great. Hey, can you help me out a little bit here? He says he wants to talk to Mr. Beginsky, but in order to do that, he needs an appointment. I can I keep telling him that, but he doesn't want to listen. Yar gar gar gar. I was starting. I was starting to think of beating. I was starting to think of beating him, to make him understand that. But that's just kind of cruel when he hasn't done anything bad, you know. <laughs> Yay! Have a good boy. No problem. I'll talk to him. <laughs> Thanks. You two, let's change locations. All right. <laughs> but then, Big Brother, I'm telling you, I, I understand. You have your own again, again, as well. Uh, agenda as well. Sorry, guys, dyslexia is real. Please, just do as I say for now on, okay? Come on, this way. Let's go now. For now, we need to get out of here. But... Do you mind waiting for a moment, please? Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Ah! <laughs> Matthew? Wait. But it wasn't even that weak of a barrier. There's no way it broke that quickly. You. Your presence feels different. You changed back to Spain, haven't you, Antonio? Yes, I remember everything. Is it because of Krillin? Or certain Italy's actions? If so, that was unexpected. HA! <laughs> That's what you get for looking down on me. BITCH! You're right. I should have been more cautious. Um, Mr. Williams? Do you know Crendo? Oh, I I'm sorry. Did I interrupt you? There's been a lot happening and... Uh... I would like to talk to him. Would you mind if I borrow Crendo for a moment? That's no problem, but... What would you like us to do with the two Velada Lokanikes? They are part of this as well. I'll take them with me. Let's change locations. I don't want to cause a stir here in front of headquarters. Come with me. But the dots. Okay, Matthew. Take us to a place where we can talk peacefully. Uh, Feliciano? What? Feliciano? Idiot! He's at the sensemen. Who knows what he'll do to us? If we follow him? Matthew just said... It himself that he just wants to talk. And you're going to trust his words? That's right. He's a relative of a huge liar. I'm sure he's using a lying. He's, he's used to lying all the time as well. I don't know that. I don't know Matthew enough to know if he's lying or not. That's why I want to talk to him. I trust you, Matthew. Let's talk. I'll tell you all of my thoughts, so please, can you do the same for me too? Legiano, this is the Northern Italy asking me, or a fella? <laughs> I don't know, but I know that at the very least, I, Legiano, want to talk to Matthew. Maple Dots, I, I see. <laughs> please, tell Kirkland that I will be at the inn room for a moment. Once things settle down, I will tell them myself about these people. Excuse me, it's early in the morning. The situation is rather complicated, so please don't say anything to anyone. Uh, duh. This way, please. I'm going with them. 
Otherwise, you need to make sure you don't do anything to screw your screw my brother over. Please do. That's kinky. Let's go. At the end, nobody will bother us unless it's an emergency. It'll be the perfect place to talk. Yay! I wonder what that was all about. I can't understand how the words they were saying, so I don't know. Philly. Philly, she unknown. Oh, 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 oh! Ha ha, wait! <laughs> That's why I thought I've seen them before. Whoa, don't laugh at me like that. My heart just skipped me. <laughs> what the? But I remember him. I thought I saw him before, so it was bothering me. Oh, was it someone you knew at all? Well, not personally, but don't you do remember? He was on the bounty a while ago. You know the man who stole a villa, hurt the guard in Marina, and bullied Mr. Braginski a Lego? It's him, for each of Vargas! <laughs> I won't let them leave easily. Anyone who hurts Mr. Birish Braginski is sad. He makes Mr. Braginski feel as my enemy. I'll go tell Mr. Braginski about them and say I will go with spools of him. Hey, so not leave your plus without permission! Oh, Vela is such an evil guy! He betrayed I- He befriended Ivan and even took our residence card. Not our. He only took the one that originally- That was originally made out of being his to begin with. Letting Vela go in on his own hurts us a lot, though. We will no longer. We will. Uh, we will. Uh, we have no idea. Uh, we have no idea how his actions will. How he'll act inside there. <laughs> it's one thing if he. If he goes in and gets himself in trouble, but if he speaks about us, we're in big trouble, I do. Mm. Let's hurry. Let's hurry up and bust our way into your grill. If we spend too much time out here, Vela might talk. You're right, Edu. We need to kill Ivan before Vela gets to, gets to him. Gets to meet him. Fuck. So, Francis, hand me your hand over the card we made for you. As of this moment, you're only a snowland. I doubt you have much useful strength if. You and you to cause a revolution against Ivan. We'll go kill Ivan. You stay here and be prepared to act if we need you for emergencies. Baggy dots. Hey, Rodolph, are you listening, brah? Baggy dots. Rodolph, what's wrong? Are you still thinking about what happened? I'm sure you understand. You used to be the one of the strongest countries. You understand we have no time to waste on those who hold us back, right? Right, Edu? Don't you think of... Don't you think so, France? That's right, Rodolf. Our duty is to do what our humans want us to do. To destroy the evil and provide freedom and peace to the world. That's what they wish for. Oh, but I'm the most important hero. You can't take care of that role. You can't take that role from me. You just, you should just be quiet for a moment. Oh, don't worry, Lev and Rodolph. You two will be, um, have amazing parts as my supporters too. <sniffs> don't call me Lev, and I don't want that stupid role. Oh, I get it, it's called and suitor, right? Shut up for once and listen, Eddie. Wonderful. That's right, no matter how much I want to deny it. And the end, uh, no, I'm right. Stop mumbling to yourself and help me out with this idiot. I know, Alfred, listen to me for a bit. What, Eddie? What is it? 
I really hate Ivan and Asa for making me go through all of this. I want to punch them in the faces so badly. But that's not Zorado's wish. It's Francis' feelings. So what I do? You're friends, so of course you feel anger and hatred towards them. <laughs> that's what I thought too. I keep telling myself I'm not Rondolf, I'm France. But in reality, that's not the case. Rondolf demo uh, France demolished years ago, and now I'm Rondolf. Ah, Patsy, Patsy! Those who, those who live in Rondolf, my people, all don't remember France anymore. Even those who lived in the dorm 60 years ago are also all in their graves now. Like Alfred said, right now, I'm just Rondolf. And that's a fact. What are you saying? Of course you're Rondolf, it's common sense. You're right. What do you want to say, I do? That because you're part of Siberia and you can't go against Ivan? Oh, no, no. Like I said, I want to punch Ivan's advice. But I, but what I am saying is that what France wishes for Adam added unto that, Randolph has a wish as well. What I do? To help out that dumb boy who believes in everybody no matter what happened. What well, that boy helped me out even after I kicked him out of the village before. With a hesitation, he risked his life to save Rodos' village uh, from harm. <laughs> this is a moving Francis. I gotta go in a bit. Shit. So as Rodolf, I thought and vowed to help him out through his journey, no matter how idiotic his plan seemed. You. So since you're on Villa's side, that means you're siding on I. You're siding with Ivan and Arthur. So you're evil too. No, no, and I hate that eyebrow freak, and I will never agree to everything he says. But that also doesn't mean I'm completely with you, Isa. I'll do how I want to, th to do things. So in other words, I disagree with both Alfred and Latha. What? You don't disagree? You don't agree with me? Your ideas don't have one bit of love and sense of beauty in it. My brother can't agree with that. It's honestly a horrible bet to see how far Fligiano can go. But if I feel, but if I left him how I know, I will regret it later. I'm sure Franz and Randolph will both agree with that. You're going to go through your life anyway again? Throw away your life again? After regaining your country status? You're going to go from your own to soak yourself in Ivan's ri ridiculous ideas? Soak myself? I don't know in that fact. I don't know about that, in fact. I think your choices must... I think your choice is the most closest to Ivan's ways right now. You even used to think the same way as Ivan did in the past. At one point... At one point? I'm sure there's one simulation there to be going with. <laughs> You're going to get in the way of the hero. Are you evil too, Rodolf? Is that how you wish to think then? Feel free. But here's this. In this world, there's more than just you and Eva. Anyway, Big Brother will take his leave now. Au revoir. Wait, Randolph! <laughs> okay, that was really dramatic. So this is where I'm going to start the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Earthcock Great. Keep going, rock on, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, Zs!